The smartest thing I did after my injury, which took took time, was getting involved with my my peers. Uh, so much before that was just the fear of the unknown. Um, but doing that, that this made a huge difference in my my life. So much confidence grew from making that that one decision to do it. But I think it's that much easier if you attend the support groups that are uh, consistently available. Uh, that's certainly one of the ways that that I learned it, uh, to learn and find the ways that you can appreciate what's available to you. Again, in my experience, it may be six months, it may be a year, but you're gonna find that you'll start driving, then that's something that you may not have even planned on. You might find that you're in a position to become an architect. You might find that you're gonna be in a relationship and get married, have children. Um, these are all possibilities that are available that you're not gonna think about. The anger is gonna go away. The opportunities are gonna come your way. Um, you know, nowadays our communities are built around giving people with disabilities the opportunity to do what they so choose to do. Um, people understand. People are there to help. Don't, don't close the door in their face. Open, open the door for them. I think that's gonna turn things around. It's not all gloom and doom. This is the hand that we're dealt and we need to move, move through it. Um, there are a lot of people that will be there for you. And if you take the opportunity to accept what they're offering, you're gonna find that you can move that much further, that much faster, and enjoy that much more of your life than you ever anticipated when you were first injured. I know, I did, I hope that you can. I've thought about what would be good advice for people to receive before they left the hospital. I'm not sure that people would listen to that. I'm not sure I would have listened to it. And when I think about it now, I think that what I would have liked somebody to tell me is that what I was about to embark on was going to be pretty scary, pretty difficult, and survivable. And that I would run into difficult situations and I'd figure some way through them. Uh, that I could learn to help myself and that I should trust that my family could help me as well. That underneath it all, that I had the ability to cope with the world in a wheelchair.